Did you know that 60% of people have reported that social media has negatively impacted their self-esteem? People troll, insult, and even bully over social media. 41% of teens have had a negative social media experience, and 22% have lost a friendship with someone due to actions over social media. Nevertheless, social media is used to connect with people, make new friends, and stay in touch with family. However, social media has been linked to increased feelings of depression, anxiety, and loneliness in teens. My name is Leela Iyer, and my invention, which I call Felicity, meaning happiness, would be able to fix all these problems and more. This innovation would be able to reduce depression, anxiety, and loneliness in teens. Felicity is an artificial intelligence or AI system designed to sense the negative implication in a comment or post and restrict it from viewers if it is degrading or insulting in any way to a group or person. As I mentioned before, social media is used to connect with people. Approximately 77% of Americans have some type of social media account. But the more you use social media, the more likely you are to have depression, anxiety, and loneliness. You see, Many people get social media for affirmation. Everyone wants more likes, more followers, and more subscribers. Also, there's an even worse thing that happens on social media. Trolling, bullying, and insulting is so much easier to do over these platforms, since you will most likely never meet the person you insult, unless it is a classmate or peer. Having to look someone straight in the eye while saying something hurtful is what stops people from doing so. But with social media, it is so much easier for people to be indecent and downright mean to one another, especially kids. Additionally, negative comments and posts make people feel like they don't belong or like they don't have many friends. My invention, Felicity, will regulate the amount of demeaning comments or posts aimed at someone, which will in turn make people feel more liked and included. Teenagers will be able to go on a social media platform without having to worry about being judged or criticized because all the rude comments and posts will be blocked. Therefore, the number of people suffering from depression, anxiety, or loneliness due to social media will be reduced. Felicity would be an artificial intelligence or AI platform with the purpose of identifying and restricting negative content in social media. It will be able to an analyze the sentiment in a comment or post, which helps distinguish between a joke and an insult. This invention would also learn from user feedback by asking users whether a comment or post sounds or feels negative. Today, artificial intelligence or AI platforms are used for many purposes and are extremely advanced. They can report news, build things, and even diagnose diseases. The specific AI platform would be used to determine the negative or positive connotation in a comment or post, which in turn, by reading a comment or scanning a post, this AI would be able to identify the sentiment. It would then restrict it and flag it as potentially negative content so that unless you deliberately click on it, people won't be able to see or read it. Also, there would be a sentiment analysis piece to it so that it doesn't block jokes, memes, or things like that. Furthermore, Felicity would learn from user feedback so that it gets better every day. For instance, if someone blocks something that wasn't mean and someone notices, then they can report it so that the AI system wouldn't do it next time. Plus, this invention would be compatible with all types of social media so that users wouldn't have to download a separate social media app. There are also a couple challenges in creating Felicity. To begin, it would be very difficult to calculate the negative, negative, negativity in a comment or post, and whether it is a joke or supposed to be funny. Imagine if a German person made fun of a German accent. Now, imagine if a Russian person made fun of a German accent. While both said the same things, the second is perceived to be more hurtful than the first because of differences in ethnicity and culture. Should both posts be blocked or just the second? This is a tough problem to fix. In order for this invention to be successful, 
it must be developed with expertise in human linguistics and psychology. Also, another difficult thing to solve is getting the AI system to be compatible with all types of social media. Every single type of social media is different. Instagram has a different layout than Twitter, and Facebook is used for different purposes than Reddit. There are many little issues to be fixed, but I'm confident that they can be resolved. The percentage of US teens and young adults reporting depression and mental distress has increased significantly over the past decade. This is a real problem in our society today, and it must be solved as soon as possible. Social media has many benefits, such as bonding with friends, having fun, and staying up to date with modern trends. Nonetheless, today, social media can be very negative, but if we were to take out everything that is insulting or hurtful, we could pave the way to a more positive experience on social media. Thank you.